Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Certified Virtual Conference. My name is Brian Nielsen, and I am the Certiport Competitions Manager. I joined Certiport five years ago, and as part of my role, I manage the strategy, the marketing, and the event logistics for the Microsoft Office Specialist and the Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National and World Championships. I always look forward to the Certified event, and especially the U.S. National Competitions, as that is such a special event for students, parents, and teachers. I'm excited to talk about the competitions today. During the presentation, we're going to cover a handful of topics. These will include an update on the 2020 U.S. National Championship, the Microsoft Office Specialist Championship Basics and some of the frequently asked questions, the Adobe Certified Associate Championship Basics and some of that championship's frequently asked questions. Some of you may be new to the competitions, never heard of them before, while others viewing this may be longtime veterans of having students compete at these great events. The 2020 Microsoft Office Specialist and Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Championships were canceled due to the difficulties resulting from the COVID-19 pandemic. This was a difficult decision for us to make as the competitions and certified are such special events. In previous years, we've had hundreds of students also at the hotel property competing at the U.S. National Championship the same time as the certified event. With the cancellation of the 2020 U.S. National Championship and a virtual competition not being an option, the 2020 Microsoft Office Specialist and Adobe Certified Associate qualifying students will be invited to the 2021 U.S. National Championship. That, will be a, um, that event will be held in June 2021 at the same time as Certified 2021. Invitations have already been redistributed to those qualifying students and they're aware that they should be attending next year's event. I wanted to give an update here so that individuals viewing this presentation know what happened to the 2020 U.S. National Championship. Next year's event will be bigger and better than any other U.S. National Championship that we've had before. Now let's get started by talking about the Microsoft Office Specialist Championship. To kick things off, I'd like to show a short video that will give you a taste of what the championship is all about. Some people say that Excel is the hardest. I just think that means less competitors. This is actually the 17th year of the Microsoft Office Specialist World Championship. When I think of the average competitor, I don't think of a person like me. Nobody thought I would have been here. They all tilt their head and were like, you, you won that? Here at this intellectual competition, these students will demonstrate who are the best of the best in Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. They will compete with students from more than 83 different countries. If he says, I want to be a Microsoft Word champion, then he will see what he needs to do to get there. He's a good racer and he likes winning, which is important. You don't know what's going to be on the test, so you kind of have to make sure you, you're good at everything. He called me and said, Dad, Dad, guess what? I won. <laughs> it made my day. To watch your child get to that point, very emotional. It's a lot of sacrifice. We want our kids to grow up better than what we went through. That's going to bring the advantage of speaking multiple languages. I feel so lucky and I think like it's inspiration for the woman who want to join into the competition. So now, how hard is the world test going to be? To be honest, it kind of freaks people out. I think he's just going to do what he's always done. Go in there, crush it, and then get out way quicker than anyone expected. And now, the world champion is... Doesn't that video give you chills? It does every time I watch it. Microsoft created this amazing 30 minute doc or created a 30 minute documentary that followed several US national champions to the world championship. The full documentary video can be viewed by visiting Certiport's YouTube channel. And it's a video that you should all definitely watch to be inspired. So what is the Microsoft Office Specialist Championship? The Microsoft Office Specialist US national championship is a competition that tests students skills on Microsoft Office Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. There are two qualifying periods, a fall qualifier and a spring qualifier, 
and we will learn more about those in the next few slides. The students with the top Microsoft Office Specialist Certification Exam score in each category during the two qualifying periods are invited to attend the Microsoft Office Specialist U.S. National Championship. I'm going to cover a handful of the most commonly asked questions that will help explain the championship. These will include who can qualify, how do students enter, what are the deadlines, why students should compete, what can students win, and what promotional materials are available for your classroom to get your students excited. The Microsoft Office Specialist Championship is for students between the ages of 13 and 22 as of June 15th, 2021. Students can qualify for the championship by earning at least a passing score in Microsoft Word, Excel, or PowerPoint in Office 2016 or Office 365 in 2019. A passing score is between 700 and 1,000. If a student earn, earn, earns a score between that range, then it's a passing score. The top scores um, for the students who are invited to the Microsoft Office Specialist U.S. National Championship varies depending on the state. In some cases, students are scoring very close to a perfect score. It's that easy to qualify, but there's something very important that all students need to do if they want to enter their exam into the championship. So how do students enter the championship? There are two ways that students can enter the championship. The first and easiest way is to opt in their exam score at the time of testing. Before the exam launches, a window will appear on the screen asking the student if he or she would like to enter their exam score into the competition. The student can either proceed without checking the box or the student can check the box entering their exam into the competition and then proceed to launch their certification exam. As their teacher, we recommend that you encourage all of your students to opt in their exam score into the competition as they launch their exam. If a student did not opt in to entering their exam score before starting their exam, or if they are unsure if they entered their exam into the Microsoft Office Specialist Championship, then the student can manually enter their exam score. To manually enter their exam score into the competition, the student will need to log in to their Certiport account using their Certi or by visiting certiport.com and then enter their username and password. After logging in, the student should click on the Microsoft Office Specialist Championship link that is located on their homepage. After clicking on this link, the student will see their exam scores that, that are eligible to be entered into the competition. To register any of the exams into the competition, the student will need to check the box next to the exam they wish to enter. And then, after doing that, they should click on the Register Selected Exams button. After doing this, they will see that their selected exam has been entered into the competition. There are two qualifying periods for the Microsoft Office Specialist U.S. National Championship. The tentative deadline for the fall qualifier is December 18th, 2020. The tentative deadline for the spring qualifier is May 14th, 2021. After each qualifying period, invitations are issued to the students with the top scores in each exam track per state. So several days after the fall qualifier deadline, the students who achieved the top score in their exam category per state will be invited to compete at the Microsoft Office Specialist U.S. National Championship. The same process is followed after the spring qualifier deadline. The invitations are distributed by email several days after each qualifying period. The invitations are emailed to the student's email address that they used when they were creating their CertiPort account. As you're helping your students create a CertiPort account prior to testing, if possible, please encourage your students to use a personal email so that they will be more likely to receive and see an invitation. Some schools block emails from unknown senders, and we would not want students to not see an invitation if they are invited. We're trying to notify teachers um, of the invited students so that they can help follow up and ensure that their students have received their invitation. A question that is often asked is how much does it cost to attend? Many previous student competitors have done fundraising to cover the traveling costs. Some districts are able to use budget, but that is dependent on your location. There are no registration fees. Students do not have a registration fee and they are allowed one free chaperone who can attend the event. If the student has additional guests they'd like to attend, such as a you know, a parent, a guardian, a sibling, teacher, or other friends, then there is a $150 fee for each additional guest. That fee is used to cover all meals for the additional guest. 
The competing students and chaperones are responsible for all travel expenses. Certiport always receives a discounted hotel rate, and that is typically $150 to $170 per night. The flight fees vary depending on where the students are traveling from and where the event is being held. All meals are provided to the students and chaperones, and Certiport always gives a few free items and prizes to all students for attending. The 2021 U.S. National Championship will be held at the Hilton Orlando Lake Buena Vista Hotel in Orlando, Florida, June 21st through the 23rd in 2021. That's a great venue that we've had the event at in the past, and we have already begun to plan for this event. We're, like I said, we're anticipating that the 2021 U.S. National Championship will be the largest and best event that we've ever had. We hope that you and some of your students can make it. So what is the schedule for the event? Day one is dedicated to students arriving, getting settled into the hotel, checking in for the event, and then having a student party. During the party, we typically serve food, bring in a DJ, some other entertainers, and some games such as ping pong, air hockey, basketball, ski ball, and lots and lots of glow sticks. It's a fun party for the students to mingle, meet other competitors, and just relax before the event. Um, day two is dedicated to testing. Each student is assigned a testing time when they check in at the event on day one. It is on this day that the competition students um, will take their U.S. National Competition exam. On day three, all attendees will attend a closing keynote session, and then we will learn who the 2021 U.S. National Champions are at the award ceremony. Once again, all meals are provided to the students, chaperones, and all paying additional guests. Three days go by quick, but it truly is an awesome event, and there are lots of awesome prizes to win. The students who are competing at the Microsoft Office Specialist U.S. National Championship have the opportunity to win some big prizes. The third place U.S. National Champion in each exam track wins $750, a bronze medal of achievement, and a winner's certificate. The second place U.S. National Champion in each exam track wins $1,500, a silver medal of achievement, and a winner's certificate. And then finally, the first place winner in the U.S. National Championship in each exam track wins $3,000, a gold medal of achievement, a winner certificate and a trophy, and an all expenses paid trip to compete in the world championship. Like, how cool is that? These are awesome prizes. The six first place winners get to move forward to the Microsoft Office Specialist World Championship and have the opportunity to win even more bragging rights and bigger prizes. I'd like to share with you the results from last year's Microsoft Office Specialist U.S. National Championship. Last year, the Microsoft Office Specialist U.S. National Championship was held in Orlando, Florida, at which 146 student finalists who had mastered Microsoft Office Word, Excel, and PowerPoint competed against one another for the Microsoft Office Specialist U.S. National Championship titles. The six students who placed first place in each exam track were named the 2019 Microsoft Office Specialist U.S. National Champions. These first place um, winners were from Kentucky, District of Columbia, Alabama, Ohio, Louisiana, and North Carolina. And they were all invited to represent the United States to compete in um, the 2019 Microsoft Office Specialist World Championship, which was in New York City. Last year was the 18th year for the Microsoft Office Specialist World Championship, and that competition attracted test takers from 119 countries. These students comp um, they competed with peers, from all over the world to prove their skills in Microsoft Office Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. Regional competitions that are similar to the U.S. National Championship were held worldwide and 155 student finalists from 50 countries gathered in New York City to compete in the final round of the competition. Certiport named the 2019 Microsoft Office Specialist World Champions, and these champions were from Taiwan, Romania, Greece, Czech Republic, the United States, and Macau. The first place winner in each exam track received $7,000. The second place winner in each exam track received $3,500. And the third place winner in each exam track received $1,500. The students um, at these events have truly mastered Microsoft Office. And next year, Certiport will host the 2021 Microsoft Office Specialist World Championship in Orlando, Florida from August 1st through August 4th, 2021. Many students who have entered the Microsoft Office Specialist um, competitions and who have even earned 
just one Microsoft specialist certification have gone on to do great things other than competing in the competitions. Students from all over, all over the world have used their abilities and real world skills to achieve their goals, to get into higher education and to secure, and to, uh, secure some awesome jobs. Some students have gone on to get jobs at the age of 15, training adults on how to use Microsoft Office in the workplace to become interns at Amazon and Microsoft or use their Microsoft Office skills in med school, even stepping into careers in networking and security engineering. A handful of these stories are highlighted in the booklet that we created, and you can download this booklet by visiting us.mosschampionship.com backslash fame. Reading and learning more about these students will get you excited about your own students and where they can go with Microsoft certification. Now, hopefully you have a better understanding of the Microsoft Office Specialist Championship, who can qualify, how students can enter, the deadlines and what students can win. Now let's talk about how you can promote this great event in your classroom. Each year, we create a handful of assets that you can access to promote the, champ the championship event in your classroom to get students excited. If you visit us.mosschampionship.com backslash media, you will see a number of assets that can be downloaded. We are currently preparing and uploading the assets for next year's event, and they will be updated before the 2020-2021 school year begins. These assets include flyers, posters, web banners, computer wallpapers, and videos. You can also request materials to display in your classroom by visiting learn.certaport.com backslash program kit. Throughout the year, Certaport is constantly driving awareness and promoting the competition events. We encourage you to subscribe to the CATC newsletter, that's the Certaport Authorized Testing Center newsletter, to receive updates on the competition, other products, other great resources. You can subscribe to the newsletter by visiting our main website. We also prepare monthly competition emails that promote the competition and share ways for educators to receive free giveaways and small items that they can then give away to their students. We also have the Microsoft Office Specialist Championship Facebook and Instagram pages that we're constantly posting on and sharing updates. We, love, we would love for you to follow those pages as well and to learn more about the competitions. Both the Microsoft Office Specialist, US National and World Championships are amazing events that give all competing students a great opportunity to show off their Microsoft Office Word, Excel, and PowerPoint skills. Um, they're able to network, connect, and are able to add this great accomplishment to their resume and just have fun. These are events that are loved by everyone that attends and they truly are something that all CertiPort employees look forward to. Additional information can, about the events can be found by visiting the two websites. We have a website dedicated to the U.S. National Championship and a website dedicated to the World Championship. If you have any questions, um, please send an email to mosschampionship at pearson.com and we'll, we will be happy to answer your questions. Now let's talk about the Adobe Certified Associate Championship. To kick off this discussion, I'd like to show a great video that will help explain the championship. Championships brings together the technical and the creative from students around the world. They come from different backgrounds, different cultures from all over, and the one common language that they have is the Adobe Suite. And the students have eight hours to be here actually designing work for a client to produce professional quality work that the nonprofit will actually hopefully use. We were approached by Certiport to be the client for this year's competition. So your job is the competition. And we thought it would be a great way for us to maybe even look at new design ideas. I think the ACA is a fantastic introduction to how life is in the real world because every single day in the real world is actually a competition. If you know what you're doing on a technical level, you're not going to waste time trying to figure out how something works. You get to use that to push creativity. It's about passion and art and feeling and design should always have that first and foremost. The quality of the work starts within the artist itself. It was layout design, it was color, it was texture, it was typography. It stretched the full gamut. Aspects wow. Wow. That's absolutely amazing. Well, you look like you've been doing this for a long time. It was unbelievable what these young people can do. That was kind of what was shocking was that they were so young and they 
did it so well. They were some of the best, um, I can say I've seen in the industry. Compared to our own in-house graphic designer, they actually were very close to what we promote as promotional materials. We really wanted to focus on picking winners that had the best overall package. The design is good, but it's missing content. It's just, it, it, it is visually engaging. So, I mean, there's got a lot of white space, but you can see so here that the, there is the bleed. And, yeah, and we have the correct sizing and naming structure. So number 26. In some ways, earning ACA certification is the first real concrete step. The first place where a world champion. The enthusiasm and the excitement in the air grows every year. They really do leave, I think, all being proud of themselves. I am Nguyen Chang Hanwei and just won the third place in ACA World Championship. More and more countries have a demand for these national competitions where students get to get together and have this cool professional experience where they're producing work for a client, a tight deadline. It's a really neat opportunity. So yeah, we, we hope to get every country someday. <laughs>
their exam scores and to submit a project in the source files for the U.S. National Championship is May 14th, 2021. After the deadline, a group of judges will review the submitted projects and source files and then judge them based on a judging rubric. The students with the top projects will be invited to compete at the upcoming Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Championship. Just like the Moss U.S. National Championship, the Adobe students have the opportunity to win some big prizes. The third place Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Champion wins $750, a Bronze Medal of Achievement, a winner certificate, and an all-expenses-paid trip to compete in the World Championship. The second place Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Champion wins $1,500, a Silver Medal of Achievement, and a winner certificate, and an all-expenses-paid trip to compete at the World Championship. The third place Adobe Certified Associate, oh no, excuse me, the first place Adobe uh, Certified Associate U.S. National Champion wins $3,000, a Gold Medal of Achievement, a winner certificate, a trophy, and an all-expenses-paid trip to compete at the World Championship. So third place is $750, second place is $1,500, and then first place is $3,000. These are all awesome prizes. The first, second, and third place winners get to move forward to the World Championship and have the opportunity to win even more bragging rights and bigger prizes. I'd like to share with you the results from last year's Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Championship. Last year was the U.S. National Championship, and this was held in Orlando, Florida. Thousands of students between the ages of 13 and 22 qualified for the Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Championship by earning an Adobe certification in Adobe Photoshop, Illustrator, and Design. These students then entered their original design creations, and 13 were selected to compete at the 2019 U.S. National Championship. Last year was the first live event for the Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Championship, and it was great to gather these amazing designers together and to have them create assets using Adobe Creative Cloud for a real client. Three students were named the 2019 Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Champions, and they are invited to represent the United States and compete in New York City at the 2019 World Championship. The three Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Championship winners were all from Texas. Last year was the seventh year for the Adobe Certified Associate World Championship. And that competition attracted contestants from 65 countries who came together to prove their skills using Adobe Photoshop, Illustrator, and InDesign. Regional competitions, just like the U.S. National Championship, were held worldwide, and 50 student finalists from around the world qualified to compete in the final round of the competition in New York City. Now, at that event, the student competitors demonstrated their proficiency using Adobe Creative Cloud software to design marketing assets. Um, and these assets were designed for a nonprofit client and were done in just a few short hours. Um, the panel of judges reviewed the final projects and determined who the winners were. And Sir Report named the student who placed first place the 2019 Adobe Certified Associate World Champion. The 20, 2019 Adobe Certified Associate World Champion, so the first, second, and third place winners, were from Macau, Peru, Sweden. And the first place winner received $7,000. The second place winner received $3,500, and the third place winner received $1,500. Next year, Certiport will host the 2021 Adobe Certified Associate World Championship in Orlando, Florida from August 1st through August 4th, 2021. Many students who have earned an Adobe Certified Associate certification have gone on to do great things other than just competing in the competitions. Students from all over the world have used their abilities and real world skills to achieve their goals, reach new levels, and to get into higher education and secure jobs that are at some awesome places. A handful of these awesome stories are highlighted in a booklet that was created, and you can download this booklet by visiting us.acachampionship.com backslash fame. Reading and learning more about these students will get you excited about your own students and where they can go with Adobe certification. These are definitely some of um, some inspiring stories, and they can give you a taste of where your students can go. I hope you have a better understanding of the Adobe Certified Associate Championship, who can qualify, how students can enter, the deadline, and what students can win. Promoting this event in your classroom is just as easy as promoting the Moss Championship. A number of assets can be downloaded by visiting us.acachampionship.com backslash media. Once again, we're currently up preparing the assets for next year's event, and they'll be updated before the next school year begins in August. You can also request materials to display in your classroom by visiting learn.certiport.com backslash program kit. 
Throughout the year, Stir Report is constantly driving awareness and promoting the competition event. And we prepare monthly competition emails to do this. And in these, in, in these emails, we share um, some great resources and ways for educators to receive giveaways and items to give to your students. We also have an Adobe Certified Associate Championship Facebook and Instagram page. And we're constantly posting on, the, on those and sharing updates. And we'd love for you to follow those pages as well. Both the Adobe Certified Associate, US National and World Championship events are amazing events that give those competing students a great opportunity to show off their Adobe Creative Cloud Photoshop and design and illustrator skills to network, connect, uh, be able to add this accomplishment and their projects to their resume and portfolio. And it's just a place for students to have fun. These are events that are loved by the competing students, our partners, parents, teachers, Adobe and CertiPort employees. And the students at these events are truly the best of the best. And it is easy for all students who are certified to enter a project and potentially be invited to compete. Additional information can be found by visiting the website listed on the screen. And if you have any questions, please send an email to achampionship at pearson.com and we will be happy to answer those questions. That concludes our presentation on the CertiPort competitions. Um, thank you for your time, and we hope to see you and some of your students at the 2021 Microsoft Office Specialist and Adobe Certified Associate U.S. National Championship in Orlando, Florida next year. Thank you once again, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Thanks.